Hey guys, it's Nakib here once again, and today I'd like to do a special unboxing of this DJI FPV combo that I just bought yesterday, and I'm so excited. Well, long story short, I really didn't have any plans to buy this FPV drone, but the story is actually I did buy a Cinewoop, and I was waiting for these goggles to arrive, but it never did. So I switched the order, and I just got this combo instead. And now I'm super stoked that I can use these goggles for both my Cinewoop and also this DJI FPV drone. Yes, thank God, I'm so so happy now. So I just decided to do a simple video of me unboxing and savoring the experience of unboxing this wonderful drone. So in the box you get these goggles of course and I was quite surprised that it felt really light. I was expecting it to feel a bit more heavier but it's nice. Mwah. And here it is guys, pièce de résistance, the drone itself. Man, it looks really nice. In fact, it looks like one of those alien movies kind of design. It actually looks just like the alien head, but it looks good and I love it. Okay, so let's go quickly through the camera specs. The sensor on this camera is a 1 2 3rd CMOS sensor and effectively it has 12 megapixels on it and it can shoot up to a maximum of 4K 60. The drone comes with just a few sensors in the front and also at the bottom. But don't be fooled that it's a Mavic Pro. It is definitely not that. The sensors will definitely slow you down, but it won't stop you from crashing into obstacles. So you definitely have to be mindful of that. So the back here is where the battery is and it can last you a maximum of 20 minutes minutes in flight and that's unheard of in an FPV drone. Okay, so let's see what we have down here. All right, so this is the remote, lovely feel. It almost feels like one of those PlayStation kind of remotes or maybe even one of those Microsoft consoles too. It feels really nice, chunky, not too heavy and it's got a nice matte finish to it. Filled with buttons at the back, it's got a good weight to it as well. Okay, so let's have a closer look at the bottom here. Well, over here, this is the USB port where you can charge your remote control and this is where you stow away those joysticks and you can always just screw them on when you're ready to fly. Quick tip, whenever you're not flying, it's best to stow away these joysticks so it doesn't mess up with your calibration. And over here we have the antenna. Pretty cool design, nice flippy design here. So at the back of the remote here is where all the buttons lies. You can control the camera, you can even control the speed of the drone from normal to sports and to full manual. There's even start stop buttons for recording and also you can change the gimbal angle which is great. Also DJI did include two sets of props which is great because flying FPV drones they'll definitely get damaged. Okay so let's see what else we get in the box. Well this is the strap for the goggles. This is the power cable to the goggles and some other cables for your phones and stuff like that. Here are the antennas for the goggles itself. So there are four of them and you just have to screw them onto the goggles itself. Man, these antennas really look good. Wearing the goggles, you'll definitely look like some kind of extra from Star Wars or something. Okay, so what else do we have here? Oh, they actually give you this green body case for the drone quite funky. Okay, so here's the battery for the FPV goggles itself. And it's really nice and small. Apparently you can use it for about one and a half hours or so. And here's the charger for your battery. Installing the goggle strap is really easy. All you have to do is just Velcro it on and it's pretty much self-explanatory. It is not hard at all. And that's basically it. That is my whole FPV setup that I just bought. And I can't wait to give it a test drive. Well, I hope you did find this video useful. And if you did, please don't forget to give me a like, share and subscribe. Oh yeah, and don't forget, there's some sample shots towards the end of this video. So do check them out. Oh, by the way, sorry guys, I don't have many sample shots, but this will do for now. I'm still getting used to this whole FPV idea, so I hope you guys forgive me. Anyway, I hope you guys did like this video. Don't forget to do all the good stuff, like, share and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.